Boys and girls, some of you didn't finish today and I said you could take home your work and work on your prototype at home. You're going to use the materials that we wrote down on the other page and you're going to include those in your design. You don't have to use all the materials. You can use some of them, most of them, or all of them. I want you to see what the paint tray is going to look like so you have some idea how it's all going to fit in. Here we go. So this is what the paint tray looks like. It's got a deep end. That's where the paint would sit. In this case, that's where your houses are going to sit. And this is very much like New Orleans. The houses are below where the water level would be. The water level would be out here somewhere normally. So your house is safe right now, but you're going to need to build a levee in here. You're going to need to build a levee somewhere between here and here on your... So I'm going to quickly make a levee. I'm not going to label it. It's not going to be a diagram. So I'm going to put my levee in here. Water gets poured in and it comes down to the levee and hopefully it kind of comes back around and doesn't get through your levee. If it does get through your levee and your neighborhood gets drowned under a lot of water, your levee has failed. So think about that when you design it. You're welcome to make a box like this. This is what it looks like if you're looking down on it. So if you're looking down on it, your houses go here, and your levee is going to go somewhere between here and here. The water gets poured in up at the top. So you can do your diagram. You don't have to create a paint box if you don't want to. You can just take the box that you have on your paper, and you can start designing your levee right there. You can imagine that your levee is running from one end of this box to the other, but you're going to have to label what goes into it. Whatever you put in your levee, you're going to have to label that. So go ahead and have fun. I look forward to seeing what you're doing when you get back. And the project itself in class is a lot of fun. Don't be surprised if your levees fail.